Hi, this is Elkin. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm going over uh, what happened yesterday. But uh, New York Post published the names, photos of 20 of the 51 or so uh, spies or uh, security experts that claim that the information in the Hunter Biden's laptop was not only false, but it was Russian misinformation. Unfortunately, now, one of those news organizations that were claiming that originally is now admitting that it's not the New York Times. So they broke ranks with the mainstream media and the tech companies and the experts. So the question is, what's going to happen now to the 51? Simple. If the Republicans sweep the Demo uh, both the House and the Senate this fall, providing that we survive a possible World War III, or avoid it, these people are facing conspiracy charges. Because that's the first thing they're going to be going after them for, conspiracy. Now, the tech companies could also be found the uh, filing conspiracy charges against them too, but with something else. Especially Twitter. Uh, Twitter could be facing additional charges, including tampering with, a, with an election. Because exactly that's what they did when they suppressed Hunter Biden's uh, information from the New York Post on the Twitter pages. They couldn't get through. And I think it happened with, the, with uh, Facebook as well, but but Twitter is the biggest offender here of all. So, I mean, not just the current CEO might be looking at jail time, so is Jack Dorsey. So, being that uh, Twitter contributed to the uh, campaign of Joe Biden, of course, they're going to have incentive to be blocking the story from the New York Post because they put their money down on this person. They want this person to win. And they were going to make sure that nothing interfered with the election in their favor. And that's exactly what the 51 security experts did the same. Now, we can't get them on, uh, on an election fraud, but conspiracy, yes. Especially since many of them were working for the government made some or not that means even more charges so there's going to be a lot of vacancies uh, next year in these positions from uh, businesses to colleges to news media because these people will be probably in court trying to avoid jail time And they said, that, oh, my tweet is dangerous. No, Twitter. You're the dangerous one. Because you're the one who put this man in office. And because of your actions, January 6th happened. Because of your actions, 13 service members died in Afghanistan. Because of your actions. People don't want to take the vaccine. Because of your actions, many innocent Afghans and Ukrainians are dying. Or had died. The key word is your actions. And there's no way of getting around it. Even if something is trending on Twitter right now. Your days of, of uh, trending might be coming to a very early ending. And if I have enough shares by then. I'll be taking over the company and firing people left and right. Telling what... Go broke and go somewhere else, you bloke. So this is Al Khan saying so long for now and don't forget your stop. And don't be like Twitter. Because now they're going to be between the rock and the hard place. Yay. Screw you, Twitter. Tweet, tweet. <laughs>